It's 8.15 a.m., and Mark Mickens and his father are about to be on the move. During the 2015 football season, Mark suffered a life-changing injury. You have such a tremendous spirit. You know, how, how do you have such a great spirit? You know, uh, I just have good faith in God, and I, I really want to persevere. And um, I know the first step in recovery is keeping a good spirit and keeping a good heart and just uh, having good traits, uh, faith in God. So that's really what I'm focusing on now. So thank you for that. How are things for you right now? Tell me what, what your day is like. How, how, how have things changed for you? Uh, I mean, I haven't been to school yet since the injury, and um, I'm just preparing to go back to school. I've been doing a lot of homeschooling and um, a lot of therapy, a lot of therapy. Mark goes to several types of therapies, one of which is massage therapy. Robin Hightower heard Mark's story and provides her time and talents freely to Mark. In her heart, it's just her way to help. Mark's Westwood family is always looking for ways to help. Westwood's head athletic trainer, Jason Nussbaum, explains. Uh, we decided as Westwood and our community that we need to do a little bit more for Mark than what might normally be expected. You know, him and his family have been through so much that we felt we needed to just go above and beyond in trying to help get what they need. Um, their biggest need right now is a van that will get him around. Um, he's you know, able to ride in a vehicle, but it's extremely taxing and strenuous on his dad, who has to lift him and put him back and forth. Uh, he has to go everywhere with his dad because um, others aren't strong enough to move him. And it's really not safe uh, for him to be in a vehicle for a long time, one, because of just the positioning, um, but two, if he's not strapped down in his wheelchair, uh, a normal seatbelt like him isn't going to hold him stable in the event uh, something could happen. So we've decided that we're hosting on Saturday, March 5th, a benefit auction and taste of the town here at Westwood High School for Mark and his family. Uh, local business owners uh, from Scotty's Cafe and Grill, Doco Smoke, and Lizard's Thicket have come together. Uh, Coca-Cola Bottling Company has donated a bunch of items, and we're going to have just a big festival. Um, we'll have kids games, food, and then an auction at 3 o'clock. So the food will start at 11 a.m. Uh, we'll keep open as long as it lasts, but probably look it's down around 5. Um, we would love families come out. Uh, there'll be a raffle, there'll be games for kids, bounce houses. Uh, our football players will be here in uniform, and it should just be a day of fun. Uh, as far as the auction is concerned, we've received a plethora of items from artwork uh, to signed sports memorabilia. We've got a signed Clemson polo shirt by Dabo Sweeney. Uh, we've got a Sean Alexander um, signed football at Alabama and for the Seahawks. Uh, we do have a website online uh, with a list of all the auction items, so we'd encourage you to go ahead and check that out as well. And if you're not able to attend the auction, uh, we'd like for you to consider being uh, involved as a sponsor um, in one of our business or family level packages, um, which will actually get you some benefits into next school year as well. Or if you'd like to give online, you can go to gofundme.com slash prayformark uh, to donate cash.